most of the plants reproduce through their seeds. But what happens to those plants which do not have seeds? How do they reproduce? Like in the case of children's favorite potato. It does not have any seeds. Then, how does it grow into a new plant? There should be some other way too, correct? It grows from its stem. It has eye on it, which develops into a new plant after some time. Same way, ginger also grows into new plant from its stem. There are some other ways of growing new plants. Like in a rose or bougainvillea, we can make small cutting of stem and plant them into soil at another place. There they grow into a new plant. Some plants like strawberry or normal grass have long stems that run along the ground. New plants grow from these stems. These are known as runners. Some plants have thick and fleshy leaves like aloe vera. They have buds on the edges of the leaves. New plants come out of these buds. There is yet another way to grow new plant. If you cut the top of a carrot and plant it in soil, you will get a new carrot plant. Same is in the case of radish and beetroot. These are the roots which grows into new plants. Some plants like ferns and mosses do not have flowers. They have spores which they grow into new plant. So, what are the ways by which plants reproduce? Mainly through seeds. Also by stems, roots, leaves and spores.